In this video, we'll be looking at systems of three equations. Our problem is to solve this system, 3x plus 5y equals negative 7, 2x plus 7z equals 2, and 4y plus 3z equals negative 8. Now the first thing that I want to do is rewrite this since I have three variables, x, y, and z. So I want to rewrite this with placeholders for the variables that are missing. So uh, our first equation, x, y, z, is missing. So I'm going to write 3x plus 5y, and then I'm going to leave a space and put negative 7 on the right side then. Our second equation is missing the y, so I'll have 2x, and then I'll leave a space for the y, and 7z equals 2. And then our third equation is missing the x, I'll leave a space here in the x column and add 4y plus 3z equals negative 8. Now I'm going to eliminate x, I think. It's already eliminated from this equation, so I'll take the first two equations and eliminate x. I'll multiply this equation on both sides by 2. And I'll multiply this equation on both sides by negative 3. So that this will be a positive 6x, and this will be a negative 6x. This equation then becomes 6x plus 10y equals negative 14. And this equation becomes negative 6x minus 21z equals negative 6. Now when I add these together, these x terms will cancel. Oh, I left my y off here. And I have 10y 21z equals a negative 20. Right. Then I can multiply this equation by 7 on both sides. And rewrite that there. So I have 28y plus 21z and negative 56. Adding these together, the negative 21z and the positive 21z cancel off. And I have 38y equals a negative 76. Divide both sides by 38. And these will cancel y equals negative 2. Now 
I'm going to put y equal negative 2 into this first equation to find x. Copy that equation, 3x plus 5y equals negative 7. Now I'll put negative 2 in here, 3x plus 5 times negative 2 equals negative 7. Do the multiplication, 3x minus 10 equals negative 7. 10 to both sides. 3x is equal to 3. Divide by 3. x is equal to 1. I still need z. Let me go ahead and put it into this one. I'll recopy that equation. 4y plus 3z equals negative 8. And 4 times negative 2 plus 3z equals negative 8. Negative 8 plus 3z equals negative 8. If I add 8 to both sides, both cancel, and I have 3z equals 0, 3, 0. z is equal to 0. Now our final step then is to write these solutions in an ordered triple needs to be in alphabetical order for the variables. So x, y, and z. Now my ordered triple is 1, negative 2, and 0.